beautiful souls, I'm Elena Angelica bringing you messages from light. Before we jump into today's reading, I would like to give a quick shout out to today's video sponsor, Keen. When Keen first reached out to me with a sponsorship offer, I was so excited I jumped and I accepted the offer immediately because Keen is a service that I use personally as well. For those of you who don't know what Keen is, Keen is a platform that provides an affordable way to receive guidance from professional psychics and spiritual advisors 24-7. I'll share a personal reason why I think Keen is so amazing, okay? So there was a time where I was going through a really difficult time. I remember getting up in the middle of the night, I couldn't sleep and I was stressed and I just really needed some answers to calm my heart down at that time, okay? And you know, when I am in this condition, when I am in a mess, I can't read my own cards, okay? And it was it was really difficult to get in with a reader because most readers are booked uh, much more in advance. So it takes weeks to get in. So I reached out to a psychic on Keen keen right there and then in the middle of the night okay and this psychic gave me some powerful messages that I will never forget okay not only did it bring comfort to my heart but she also predicted a few things that have come true for me so I do believe that keen has really good psychics and the best part is that there is always someone online to speak to you any time of the day okay because they are available 24 7 and you also have the option to text okay and I know that it's hard for some of you to be able to call and speak you know because you're, you're probably surrounded by a lot of people you know and so having the option to text is amazing right it's kind of like you know chatting with a friend except it's a psychic friend you know who can give you answers now I've also had many of you reach out to me asking if I just did a one question reading you know because you just want one answer you know you're looking for clarity in love in your relationships in your career your finances and I don't do one question sessions okay and I'm also usually booked out weeks in advance so I think Keen is a really good option for you, not only to get an affordable reading, but also professional guidance. Now Keen is being really generous, okay, and they are offering my followers a special discount. When you book through my link, trykeen.com slash Eliona, you will receive your first 10 minutes for only $1.99. Remember, you have to use my link to get this discount, okay? I will place my link in the description and in the comment section down below. Now after the 10 minutes, the price will then depend on the advisor that you choose now know that the service is also backed by a satisfaction guarantee okay so again click on my link trykeen.com slash Eliona to try your first 10 minutes for only $1.99 now when you click on this link you will be taken to their website to sign up there you will be asked a couple of questions this is in order to match you with the psychics or the advisors that suits your needs the best okay so I think this is a really amazing offer to have you know getting a psychic a professional psychic reading for less than two dollars I think that is amazing okay so again I just want to say thank you to my sponsor Keen thank you for offering this amazing deal and this amazing discount to all my followers thank you again now let's jump into your card selection and look at your full moon eclipse energy. Welcome group one, let's look at your messages. So group one, this full moon eclipse is gonna be a turning point in your life, okay? I see endings, new beginnings. It's, it's time to move on from your past. It's time to leave your comfort zone, okay? I see this as a true turning point in your life, okay? This is the time for you to step out of the shadows, okay? It feels like you have been in the shadows long enough. It is your time to be seen and heard, okay? So for some of you, I feel y'all are amazing writers, okay? So if you are looking to, to share your messages, to, to publish a book, to write a book, or, or to publish your words somehow if you're looking to be heard, okay? This is the time where the universe is going to pick up that energy and put it out to the universe, okay? People are going to see you. You are going to be seen, okay? 
I see that a lot of your work, a lot of your channeling comes through at night. Okay, so the night is the time where you want to sit down and really focus, do your work, your meditations and things like that. But it is not the time for you to be going out during this eclipse season. Okay, so the week of the eclipse, you know, from the one week from now till the full moon try not to go out at night try not to go out to nighttime um, have any nighttime activities because you know a lot of things can happen for you at night the energy is really focused on you at night okay also things are changing for you by the minute okay it's like you are going through this massive fluctuation in life and everything's not as it seems when you think that oh i know this is what i want to do this is the direction i'm going in and then things change your part is just change 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 because you are moving to to the part of your destiny so what i'm hearing for you group one is just don't overthink anything okay don't overthink things and just flow with the energies all right whatever that you hear now there is some deception or things are cloudy things are not accurate okay even if you go for um a checkup perhaps a uh a medical test right the test will not be accurate okay so just you know hang in there okay i also see that you need to set equal um an equal energy exchange it feels like you have been giving too much so this full moon is time for you to really put in your boundaries okay i also see your boundaries being tested okay so ensure that you stay calm and centered set your boundaries don't let anyone push you around okay um i am seeing a need for you to go vegetarian during this eclipse this new this full moon eclipse um you have a strong connection to mother earth and the animals so a lot of the animals will be coming in giving you signs right but you know so if you want them to help you you might want to stop eating your friends okay so go vegetarian around the full moon around the eclipse okay connect to your to your guardian um, to your animal guardian as well. I'm also hearing the dragon guardian. So you want to connect to your dragon guardian Okay, you are moving into a new direction You're moving into the direction of your life purpose and for some of you you have already been in the direction of your life purpose But your life purpose is changing because you have completed your lessons You have completed your past karmas including your past life karmas. So it's now time for you to move in a new direction Okay um, you are deeply protected and it's just I'm seeing you being you know freed from whatever that you were stuck in before It's a complete new life from here. You know, you're not gonna have any of the old experiences. Look at that new beginning Okay, you're not gonna have any of the old experiences It's like life is just gonna be so beautiful from here. You are free to move in this beautiful new direction Okay, group one try to have more passion bring more passion do what you enjoy because i feel like in the past you were doing what was necessary to survive so what spirit is saying now is that you know you can finally do what you are passionate about you can live the you know according to your life passion i see families coming together i see soul families coming together i see love strengthening within your family your tribe your soul family okay i see fated meetings some of you are starting uh, looking to start a family i see that as an option coming in for you it's like an opportunity for that as well of coming together okay um and if you're looking to have a child right you're looking to grow your family here we have this energy here as well but fertility does not just mean you know having a child or you know bringing uh, a child into your life or a pet into your life i also see it as an energy where you are able to now give birth to new ideas okay to do something new in your life you are in that beautiful place you are truly guided by your spirit guide so trust in the messages coming through to you okay your guides are directing you just flow you might feel like you are not sure where you're moving to there's a lot of uncertainty but all you need to do is trust that they know where you need to go okay you can expect miracles around this time okay and but in order for the miracles to come in you need to do a detoxification for your body you need to change the energy of your body group one there is this need for you to detox clean your energy that's why the first thing that i saw was you know going vegetarian don't put death into your body okay so this this whole week you need to do detoxing you know eat a lot of vegetables eat a lot of fruits um doing a lot of energy clearing using water as well okay clearing your energy okay you need to have the strength and the courage to 
to move through this energy because you now have the wisdom that you need through all your past experiences to move in a new direction okay we have got love twice in your reading so a lot of you will be meeting soulmates at this time okay or if you're not going to meet a soulmate now what i'm seeing for you group one is that the universe is is clearing the path okay getting the thing getting getting the path ready and getting the whole energies um, and situation ready for you to meet each other okay so it's like they are they are planning on both sides for them and for you in order for your parts to cross okay so that is just um so so beautiful okay you are moving through the next passage of your life it's like the next chapter of your life okay that whole the whole thing in the past felt like it was very stressful for you but right now you know you're moving towards a place where there is just beauty all around you your life is beautiful you will truly feel like you know you are surrounded by beautiful people beautiful things okay you yourself you feel beautiful okay you have grown so much all right this last um the last few years in your life i see tremendous growth and what i see for you this eclipse is that you're going to be manifesting all your dreams okay you're going to be manifesting your deepest desires your it's like a dream come true so this eclipse for you is beautiful okay you're not going to see a lot of um you know difficulties whatever change that comes in is a change that you have been waiting for okay so this is just the beginning and you're going to be given even more opportunities to keep moving through this i see like a passage that you're moving through okay as you move through this passage you keep getting amazing blessings okay we also have a blessing here for good work we have a blessing on your love okay a blessing on your love and then we've got love here okay and where's the other love card is around here somewhere here we go the wild rose fairy love okay so it's all about love love is coming into your life okay soulmates are coming into your life soul tribes are coming in people who carry so much of love your heart is opening your heart is healing group one it's just beautiful beautiful energy keep working with the rose quartz keep working with um rose essence okay because that is the energy that you want to bring in and that's the energy that you're going to be surrounded by okay this is just such beautiful energy okay we have a blessing for healing and injury or illness okay and the last one here we have the blessing of earth like i said you are protected by mother earth okay so working with the elements working with the children of mother earth okay the animals with the trees now again fertility we've got two cards here fertility okay so it's a perfect time for you to start new ideas new projects okay give birth to new conditions in your life all right one last card we have you have been indoors for too long go outside and get some fresh air so this new moon this um this new sorry not new moon this full moon eclipse it's important that you spend time outdoors just try not to go out at night okay if you need to look at the moon you want to watch the eclipse watch it from inside your home don't go anywhere um at night by yourself um ensure that you lock all the doors and things in your house because this energy can be prone to people breaking in you know things like that but besides that you know you are in a beautiful space just you know just work on cleansing your energy and and you know raising your vibration okay and you can expect miracles to come into your life okay that's all i have for you group one thank you for watching i'll speak to you in the next video welcome group two let's look at your cards so group two right away i see that there is a healing happening to the divine masculine energies within you okay you are healing that part of you you are healing the conditioning that has put upon you you have been if you are female you're healing the, the the conditioning that you know women need to be this way you cannot do this that's what men do that's what women do okay and if you are a male then you are healing the part of you that tells you that you know men have to be this and men have to be that right you're healing that part is coming into a beautiful balance of feminine and masculine energies within you okay i'm also seeing it's like the end of a karmic cycle here where you were connected to to difficult men in your life okay you could have had the you always have difficult relationships with men either your father your brother you know your partner right so what i'm seeing here is that that part of your life is changing okay this after this um this beautiful 
full moon eclipse you're going to be in a position where you will have the divine masculine coming in to protect you okay they want to look after you so i see you know beautiful energy there is passionate passionate love there is you know there is this very sensual nature of you know that 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 kind of energy coming in you know comfort good food good okay um there's a change. I see you also going back to like traditional ways of doing something. I see you going back to old magic. Okay. You have the ability to work with old magic. Okay. So like fairy magic, elemental magic, nature, you know, um, it's like witchcraft and things like that. But you're going back to, you know, the old ways of doing things where you are truly connecting your energy. And instead of just you know doing very basic manifestations you are manifesting in a different way okay group two you are in a beautiful position to receive amazing amazing things coming into your life group two okay but it's hidden at the moment you can't see it yet because things are still cloudy okay you are moving towards uh towards your destiny towards uh, the the place that is going to set your legacy this is big group two okay there's something big coming in for you but they're not telling what it is yet it's hidden okay but we have jupiter returns okay benefit so this is big beautiful blessings coming in okay so whichever way that you're moving in you know it may seem like it's not good at first it may seem like oh you know there is this is just nothing i haven't received anything good yet but i see this transforming into something really big okay because when it's your destiny and legacy it's huge okay some of you i see you traveling going somewhere as well okay um there might be some some restrictions here and there towards the end of um towards the end of the month you might feel like you're going through the dark night of the soul you might feel like it's it's difficult you know we've got the the solar the solar eclipse in december and we have the Saturn uranus uh transit the square transit and the end of the month in december as well 24th december okay so i feel like you're gonna go through a difficult time there and think that this does not seem like blessings this is this is okay you know this is hard and this is depressing and and you know but throughout this time you just gotta trust that the universe knows what it's doing okay it's working its way to bring this into your life and you have to just go through that one last dark night for this to come in okay in order to help you through this time all you need to do is work with the fairies work with fairy energy work with magic okay work with earth earth's energy okay do candle magic do rituals those are the things that i see for you okay i also see uh, air travel coming in um i see you moving going somewhere going to a foreign land somewhere far away because i see air travel okay and i see like a different religion you know a different culture so you're going somewhere far okay some of you you might be meeting soulmates um your soul tribe and i feel like that person or those people are from a different culture or a different um, different group of people okay you're just you're not used to to that energy and I see this amazing amazing new energy new influences coming into your life okay and again we've got a part of fortune increase so there is an there is um, an energy where it's bringing in luck so if some of you if you have bought um, a lottery ticket in the past there's a chance where you might even win the lottery um, around this time okay so let's look at your cards let's see what else you need to know okay jumping okay so I see that you just need to flow okay you need to flow with the energies the truth will be shown to you okay the truth will be shown to you you gotta have the courage to move forward in life and don't hold back okay have the courage to change your energy to move in this new direction to bring instability into your life I see your family being affected as well right there's, there's this energy of the truth coming out okay and you need to have you need to come into acceptance that it is what it is this is what it is okay and there's nothing that you can do about it right this is all part of the divine plan trust that the, that the universe knows what it's doing even if it feels like it hurts right now okay just take time off you might want to go to a retreat somewhere you may want to travel somewhere okay i see you just needing to 
to flow with this energy because you know it is it is honestly whatever that's happening is happening for you although it does not seem like that it seems like the universe hates you and it's literally picking on you right and it's like I, what i see for someone it's like you feel like the universe is stepping on you while you are already down but you just need to know that that's not what's what's happening it's all happening behind the scenes you can't see okay what you're seeing is right straightforward that feels like it hurts okay but once you flow through the eclipses and you come across to the other side next year things are gonna change for you okay dreams look at that dreams and then we've got manifesting dreams here okay this is a dream come true for you okay group to trust trust that okay we've got spirit guide you know so your guides are truly helping you they are freeing you from whatever that was holding you back if you could not win the lottery in the past you could not get your your a certain i feel like some of you were trying to get a certain project a certain um contract okay and you were unable to get that that's because you were still tied to this old energy and now the universe is removing that energy from you and that's where you're going to see everything change okay look at that financial health okay so there's a lot to do with your finances um i see that improving okay it's like you're going to be shown what to do where to go okay trust in whatever that's coming in here okay you are truly going to heal at this time it's like the only reason why you, you were, you know, having low energy or feeling really, really down, really depressed, that is because you were still tied to that old energy, okay? Now that you're moving forward, um, things are going to change, you are going to heal, your body's going to heal as well. You're going to be shown what you need to take, okay? I'm hearing this for someone specific here, or a few of you here. Um, if you have been feeling really down, really low, um, feeling like you have no energy, right? Um, look into your your vitamin b intake perhaps you want to get some supplements vitamin b supplements get uh, a supplement that has a few of the different vitamin b's um take that that will help with your energy levels okay that will help with your anxiety that will help with your energy okay um i am seeing a change in your home so some of you may be moving to a new home or looking or starting the process of buying a new home okay i see you moving to a beautiful part of the land if you're moving to a new home ensure that you go in and you bless the land that you are going to be living on okay you have tremendous protection and beautiful you have not just protection but you have built a friendship with inner earth with, with mother earth with that beautiful fairy energy okay i see all these different elemental beings coming in to work with you okay group two it's like all this um it's like it's a completely different elemental beings that are coming in to work with you right now okay so and they have formed this beautiful friendship with you so they're working with you not like i'm a higher guide guiding you you know they're not like your angelic guides coming to guide you they're like your friends who are going to be with you okay who is who are going to just you know work their magic to make things you know work out for you okay let's see what else you need to know so we have a blessing to ease loneliness and bring companionship we have a blessing on your intuition here we've got that and a psychic ability here okay so trust your intuition and again work on your gut okay because right now you are finding it a little bit hard to trust your gut because you have gut problems okay you have been through bullying before you've been through a lot of trauma that's affected your gut okay so ensure that you go and take your vitamin b's to help to heal and um maybe look into kombucha and things like that something that can help you heal your gut okay and then you can trust your gut <laughs> okay we have a blessing on your love okay blessing on your love some of you could be meeting um the love of your life if you are single looking for a man then there is a, a beautiful blessing of this energy of the man coming into your life because we did get a connection to the divine masculine energies okay um also if you do not meet this person this month or this week right this week is where the universe paves the path to ensure that the that your paths will cross okay in order for you to meet okay now we have a blessing on your boundaries and a blessing of protection from mother earth and the last one is the blessing to find the truth 
okay so the truth is going to be shown to you and you're not going to be happy when you hear the truth but just know that you have the courage to move through this okay and while the truth hurts it will free you from the chains that have been holding you back for so long okay so just flow and as you're going through the dark night just know that just know that there is hope okay this is just a, a, this is just a short time this is just a short period and this time will pass okay it's just a bad time and the time will pass you will come out on the other side and life is going to be beautiful okay it's like the most beautiful life you've ever had okay the universe is pouring its abundance out to you be open to receiving prosperity take a risk put your heart and put your heart through desire into action okay take a risk and put your heart through desire into action and then we have you are just getting started so have patience with yourself and the process do not give up and the last one is stop worrying everything is going to be fine okay we've got Lakshmi there everything is going to be fine if, if you look at your cards right Lakshmi you know the the goddess of, of abundance of the bright future of money of wealth of prosperity right all your cards keep leading to prosperity so I do see a, a sudden you know financial um, raise a financial ab ab abundance coming into your life okay that's all I have for you group two I hope this helps I'll speak to you in the next video welcome group three let's look at your messages so group three out of all the groups your group is going to be affected the most during this lunar eclipse okay you are going to be experiencing dramatic changes in an unforgettable way you are going to be tested you are going to be isolated there is so much going on your emotions are going to be like crazy i see you going through huge emotional changes needing to heal your emotions okay there is a lot happening for you this week okay during the eclipse group tree so take it easy ensure that you protect your energy protect yourself protect your interest that's something that i see you need to do um there's a strong connection to the gender identity so for some of you you could be coming into acceptance of your gender identity some of you could be you know coming out of the closet you know some of you for someone here i feel maybe you're going to learn about your child you're gonna your child's gonna come out come out to you you know and tell them about what they feel they are okay so this is where i feel like you really need to work with your emotions stay calm okay stay calm no matter what people say if you come out and you, you know you come out and and tell people that this is who i am now and this i'm you know i need you to accept me in this way and they don't this is where you need to just set your boundaries and walk away okay do not get into fights because i am seeing this 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 energy of you know mars energy is like fire right but at the same time you don't want to hide and you know let people walk all over you or take away what is what is important to you okay so there is this need here where you may you do need to protect your interest okay it's like a call to battle okay fight for what is yours so that's what i'm seeing for you okay so you may be a little shocked as to what comes in you know how you know, like who comes in and tries to push you off your feet okay so that is something that i'm seeing it's going to come in very quickly it's like very unexpected okay it's like i see like a storm a storm suddenly coming in and going out and this storm will last right till the end of december after which things will change okay i am seeing a connection here to a mother um to a child there might be um domestic issues there um there's a lot of um childlike energy some of it is to do with your inner child okay it is you are growing up group three you are growing up into the next phase of your life okay so just you know be okay with with standing alone okay i feel like all eyes are going to be on you so you know don't resist what is happening own it own your power own whatever that you are trying to own okay if someone's trying to pull you down okay just just stand alone right and own whatever that is being thrown at you okay whatever that is yours as well okay um i also feel like it's a need for you to master a new tool so perhaps you want to look into how you can get some help um 
with an online platform technology internet okay i do see that there's like messages and things coming through or help coming through via technology okay so let's look at what else you need to know i see you moving towards a phase where you're gonna see life is beautiful again okay but you just have to go through this 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 phase here where you can finally see the beauty in yourself again i feel like you have been denying a part of you for a very long time perhaps if you are a mother and you know after having children you lost that part of yourself i see you now taking back that power okay you're finding yourself again where it's like it's a lot to do with your vessel it's it's like you're healing your vessel okay i am seeing that for you okay now let's look at what else we have okay i see beautiful um self-love you're working on self-love and as you 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 begin to love and have compassion for yourself i see um true love coming into your life as well okay there is going to be issues within your home some domestic issues there but whatever that's happening it is happening to transform you okay to transform you into the most powerful soul that you are because you group three you are stepping into your life purpose as well okay this is destiny it's part of your life purpose there's something that you need to do in order for that to happen this you need to free yourself from from where you were you need to find yourself again okay you're also getting a third eye activation so you are going to be shown the way that you need to go it's like you will get the message right you need to do this you feel it strongly within your heart okay you need to do this you've got to trust okay you got to trust what you feel okay you your messages are on point okay you need to trust that because i feel like you've hidden a part of you okay you've hidden a strong part of you maybe some of you have the psychic ability that you are afraid to share with others so now you're going to come out of the closet and say that guess what I'm magic. <laughs> I'm psychic. <laughs> I can see things. Okay, so maybe you come from a religious family that says that, oh, that's, you know, working with the devil and things like that. And then now you come out and go like, you know what? I'm working with light. I'm working with God. And God has given me this gift. And I'm going to accept it. I'm going to embrace it. I'm going to nurture it. Okay? Nurture your energy. Okay? It's all about you finding yourself again. Finding that joy in life again. Okay? Have confidence with your gift. Have confidence with what you can do. You're going to have new tribes coming in. I feel like, you know, you're being asked to go join a group. Being part of something. Finding people who are like you okay so maybe using the internet to connect to people that's why i saw you mastering a technology i saw messages i saw like air messages air travel you know things like that right the air element so i feel like maybe it's you know you need to connect online find find an organization a group that is like you okay and um connect to them okay i do see that there's a lot of um this is need to escape the normal world that you've been in the mundane world because you are not like everyone else group three okay you are in a place here now to give um give birth to new ideas new situations new energy okay and it's also time for you to master this new gift not this new gift the gift that you have you know suppressed for so long okay it's time for that gift to come up here you will be protected as you stand your ground you need to trust that okay it's like you are connected to earth's magic so you know earth will protect you you've got you've got helpers in different realms okay you've got helpers in other realms that most people don't even talk about you know most people talk about the angelic realms about inner earth about the the galactic realms you you are connected to this other realm that people don't really talk about so you're getting protection from them it's just magical group three you are a magical being okay um it's time for you to transcend your your humanness <laughs> if that makes sense okay it's time for you to transcend that because you are tapping into a new energy okay you are coming to towards a new beginning okay there's a new beginning where you will find sanctuary you'll find safety a place where you can go to you you know like going back to your family or going back to uh, people who understand you it's like you're meeting your soul tribe okay so there is beautiful beautiful energy there but you've got to take charge here okay you've got to take charge and just go with it okay you are not going to be sure how people are going to respond how people are going to react but you just got to go with it you got to come into acceptance of who you are and what is happening okay don't fight whatever that's happening so as you're going through this difficult time the dark night whatever just you know flow 
okay flow and tell yourself this will pass these two will pass okay you have been through so much already anyway so try not to let the energies get you down okay work on healing and and work on this this you need to bring more play more fun into your life you've become very serious okay learn to be more flexible have more fun okay let go of your old self okay let go of your old self okay one last card here joy you need to bring more joy into your life group tree okay as you're going through this difficult energy it's important that you bring more joy into your life okay let's look at what blessings are coming your way okay what blessings are coming your way during this beautiful eclipse okay we have a blessing of the waters okay blessing of the water so ensure that you are also drinking clean water drink alkaline water to clean your your system okay to clean your gut drink alkaline water um, do a lot of water healing spend time near bodies of water and what i feel for you as well you know i'm seeing with the water i'm seeing the lotus okay so it's like you know the lotus has to grow through the muddy waters and then once it comes out it blooms it only blooms when it's out of the murky water okay that's what i'm seeing for you you are just moving through now and you're gonna bloom soon okay you're reaching a new level of enlightenment okay so just know that all these downloads messages coming through you're reaching a new level of enlightenment your intuition is just getting stronger because you know you are coming to this new place of power you have a blessing on your creativity okay you have a blessing to do good work you have a blessing on your day okay so day to day look for the little blessings in your life as you're going through a hard time because i am seeing you know a bit of a difficult energy you know with the dramatic energy needing to fight for what is right you know people trying to pull you down this this energy of isolation of transformation okay so you can feel a bit difficult but as you're going through that just look for the blessings every day the little blessings that you have you have water to shower it's a blessing thank you universe you have water to drink thank you thank you universe okay so count the little blessings we also have a blessing for unity where there was once division okay and the last one here oh, two cards jumped out we have a blessing on your sleep okay and a blessing on growing older okay so that's a beautiful blessing to have let's just get a few more messages from the goddesses let's see what you need to know group three here we go so group three we have be bold unleash your adventurous side take risks and be daring and then we have something to do with your home okay so there are two cards here that's talking about your, the energy of your home okay so it says your household situation will improve either through a move or a healthy change in the occupants Okay, either you're going to kick someone out or you're leaving to a new home. Okay, you are becoming increasingly sensitive, avoid harsh relationships, environments, situations, and chemicals. And I like this. This is the white Tara that talks about sensitivity. But if you look at the image in the, on the card, right, it's to do with, um, you know, she's on a lotus. And you know how I said you are, you know, I see you coming out of the water, sitting on a lotus. I mean, blooming like a lotus, right? This is what I see. So maybe what you can do is when you want to do a meditation, visualize yourself sitting in a lotus on top of the water, floating on the water. Sit there, do the meditation as you pull in light into your body, okay? I just saw that for you, group three. So do that meditation. And the last one says that, this situation involves past life memories so i feel like whatever gift that's coming into you it is a gift that you had from a past life or whatever energies that's coming out of you now where you need to accept and embrace that is coming from a past life energy okay you're also going to be meeting past life um past life tribes past life um connections that's why you're being asked to go out and join a group of people it's like you're going to meet this group of star seeds or a group of you know artists and all of them who have been connected to you in a past life okay just know that group three you are a magical person who can manifest your clear intentions into reality so you know keep your energy high fight for what is right and just see the blessings in every day let go of what needs to go okay don't don't hold on to hatred don't hold on to anger just know that whatever that's happening whether it is your whether you feel like you're being attacked by people um you know um not physically obviously if you physically please you know look 
get help okay <laughs> go and re make a police report or something but if i feel like you feel you're energetically being attacked by people you feel like you're being you know singled out just know that it's happening for a, a higher purpose okay there's a reason why that is happening okay you need to just let them go don't hold on to it and say that this has to happen so that i can move on to the next phase of my life okay i can move on to the path of my greatest destiny the you know there's this energy of truly embracing what god has given you in every life okay that's all i have for you group three thank you for watching and i'll speak to you in the next video